After the highs of Mirabai Silver on day one, it was a day of lows on Sunday. Welcome to the new Indian Express Bulletin on the Tokyo Olympics. Indian rowers Arjun Lal Jat and Arvind Singh have secured the semi-final spot in the men's lightweight double skulls event after finishing third in the Ripa Shah's round. In lawn tennis, India women's doubles pair of Sanya Mirza and Ankita Raina have been knocked out of the Tokyo Olympics as they lost to Ukraine's Kitchenock sister 6067-10-8. In shooting, Manu Bhakar and Yashishwani Singh failed to qualify for the finals of the 10-meter ear pistol. The former's pistol had a malfunction which cost her around some important minutes during the qualification round. Deepak Kumar and Divyan Singh could not move into the final of the men's 10-meter ear rifle. PV Sindhu defeated Israel's unseeded Poli Karpova in straight games. 21-7, 21-10. The sixth seed just took 29 minutes. In table tennis, Ji Satyan lost to Lam Sui Hang in a 7-set thriller. The former had a 3-1 lead but lost the last three to be knocked out to the men's singles. In the women's singles, Manika Batra defeated world number 32 Pesotska 4-3 to reach the third round. Indian boxer Maricom defeated Hernandez Garcia to reach the round of 16 while men boxer Manish Kaushik was shown the exit door by Luke McCormack. In hockey, the men's team were thrashed 7-1 by Australia in the second match of the group stages. In swimming, both Srihadi Nataraj and Mana Patel failed to reach the semi-finals at the respective 100-meter backstroke heat. The lone Indian gymnast at Tokyo, Praniti Nayak, failed to qualify for the all-round finals on Sunday. Gymnast Simran Biles did not have the best of starts to a Tokyo campaign. The USA finished second behind Russia in women's team qualifying. World number one Ashley Barty has crashed out of the women's singles after a loss to Spain's Sara Soribes Tormo in straight sets. Also, Andy Murray withdrew from the men's singles at the Tokyo Olympics due to right quad strain.